everyone. Welcome back to a real out with me and nobody else. And today's book is about George's woolly hat in a Peppa Pig book series miniature version. And today's book is about it is a very windy day and George has a new woolly hat. Everyone promised Mummy Pig that they won't get George hats muddy. Can they keep their promise? I don't know, but we're going to read this book and find out. Peppa Pig, George Woolly Hat. Peppa and George are spending the day at Granny and Grandpa's pig house. George is wearing a new woolly hat. Don't get your new hat muddy, George, said Mummy Pig. We promise not to get George's hat muddy, says Grandpa Pig. Peppa and George are playing in the garden. It is a very windy day. Hold on to your hat, says Peppa. Wah, cried George, his hat, as his hat sailed up into the sky. Catch it, George, shout Peppa. I'm obviously can reach it, but their hands are short. George chased his woolly hat right through the mud. George, you're all you are all muddy, cried Peppa, but George's hat is still clean. The wind blows his woolly hat across the garden. Oh, oh no, George's woolly hat is caught up in a tree. I'll get it down for you, said Peppa. Grandpa Pig and George watch as Peppa climbs up in the tree. Perhaps I should help, said Grandpa Pig. Whoops, cried Peppa. Poor Peppa has fallen from the tree and landed in the mud. I see you two little piglets, piglets who need a bath, says Grandpa Pig. Next, George's hat blows onto some needs in the pond. Luckily, your hat is luckily your hat is still clean, George, says Pe says Grandpa Pig. He grabs the stake and reaches across the pond. Don't fall in, says Peppa. I know what I'm doing, Peppa replies Grandpa Pig. Mm, I'm sure about that. You okay? Splash! Grandpa Pig falls into the pond. That, that was a silly thing to do, said Granny Pig. We were trying to get George's hat back, Granny, says Peppa. Where is George's woolly hat now? asked Granny Pig. Granny Pig spotted the hat. It has landed in a spade on top of a stinky manual. Ugh. If you walk on that manual, you'll stink. You'll sink, warns Grandpa and Pig. Hush, Grandpa Pig. I have no intention of sinking, said Granny Pig, laughing. Mm, I'm scared. Carefully. Granny Pig climbs over the manual until she reached the woolly hat. Got it, she shears, but then, okay. Granny Pig falls over and let it in the heap of stinky mantra. Ooh, smelly Granny, said Peppa. Grandpa Pig, Peppa, and George start to giggle. <laughs> Mummy Pig arrived to collect Peppa and George. You promised not to let the children get money. muddy, said Mummy Pig. Actually, we promised, we promised not to get George's hat to get muddy, said Grandpa Pig. George's hat is the only clean thing, says Mummy Pig. Yep. That's a very funny story about how the whole entire helper get muddy, except for the hat.
<laughs> Hope you all enjoy, and if you want me to read another Peppa Pig book, perhaps the big ones, please show me what kind of books do you want. And have a nice night.